This video is going viral. Walmart's locking everything up, and while well, you're not gonna guess why, make sure you watch till the end. This is pretty freaking sad that everything in Walmart is locked up. This is what the world's come to. I mean, really guys? Really? I have to wait for somebody to come and bring me or give me dishwashing liquid? Yep. Unreal. <laughs> Supposedly after the new year, this is supposed to be happening at almost every Walmart across the United States of America. Because of the high thefts and crime, well, you never know. I want to know what you guys think of this in the comments. And if this happened at your Walmart, well, would you stand around and wait for dish liquid? Charlotte Wom. This video is going viral. Walmart's. First and foremost, all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh Bahashem, Yahweh Shai Bahashem Rekar Kodash. Yahweh is the true name of the Heavenly Father. Bahashem means in the name. Yahweh Shai is the name of His only begotten Son. And Rekar Kodash is the Spirit Holy, which is the Holy Spirit. I'm the brother Yasharala with Great Millstone Chicago, or oh, Salakia. Double honors to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone. Salutations to the hopeful elect pushing this word in truth and in sincerity. To the Israelite foreigners scattered throughout the four corners of the earth who may look like the heathens. And to the very few sisters that listen and learn to you, Shalom. I'm the brother Yasharala with the Great Millstone Chicago. And as you see, uh, I downloaded this video off of TikTok where um, they're starting to lock up products in, in walmart and um you know you, you had something also like this let me see um let me see uh what is it called i think it was um with the walgreens um you know what, let me type in new, new coolers. See if that comes up. Right. You know what? Um, what the hell? So it says um, Walgreens digital cooler doors. All right, I'm not gonna play it, but um, basically, um, you know, I guess I'll play it. So um, and also in Walgreens, you got these coolers that um, they have these sensors. I don't know if you can see it. Let me see. These sensors that are right there. Which, you know, we believe in the near future, they're um, locking down product in order to be activated, opened with your um, RFID radio frequency identification device, which is the mark of the beast. All right. That which is um, going to be implemented in the near future. All right. And um, as you can see, they're doing it in Walmart now because of a lot of theft and uh you know esau is gonna use theft in the stores and these big these big chain stores are gonna use theft as a reason why to why to lock everything down all right and to very well possibly have you scan your um your chip or right, your device in order to gain access to these products now they already got facial recognition in walmart you walk in they are they already know who's coming in their stores right so it's not going to be a hard thing for them to implement this system all right and um 
You know, they're going to use, uh, oh, theft. Uh, Walmart reported that, you know, certain ones in Chicago that they've been closing down. They haven't been making any profits because, you know, let me see if I can find it. You know, I'll just look up the video. This should pop it up. I put getting. Where you had these three, uh, you had these three black girls right here. Here we go. Anyways, where they were eating um, f food in the store, saying we eat for free, you know. But um, nonetheless, you know, Esau's going to use this, all right, to um, implement his new system. This is 2 Corinthians 2 and 11. Least Satan shall get an advantage of us, for we are not ignorant of his devices. All right, and this is going to be one of his, another one of his devices, another one of his tricks, locking every damn thing down in the store, right? Um, I don't know if anybody's been in the Amazon stores uh, where shit, you, you just sign into your account, you know, you um, have it on your phone and you scan in and you basically just put everything in your cart and you could just walk out you know, and it'd be added to your account. All right. Um, so this isn't far fetched from from um, Esau to have a system where everything's locked. And in order to gain access to them, you know, you will have to um, use use your device. All right. Like how Walgreens has those those new coolers where there there is a reader on there. You know, but right now they're not being used to unlock, you know, the to unlock the door. But the, the technology is there. All right. Let's grab uh, let's grab it in Revelations. This is Revelations. Thirteen and sixteen, and he causeth all, both small and great, rich and poor, free and bond, to receive a mark in their right hand or in their foreheads. All right, which um, we believe this to be the RFID, all right, radio frequency identification device, which they're already in your credit cards. You know, they're also known as NFC, near field communication, you know, but uh, let me put a chip. You see, they're getting ready to implement this. All right. So they could um, know what's being sold, what's being bought, because that's what it goes into. And that mark. All right, is um something that's inserted, okay? And your right hand isn't necessarily your right hand; it's just your basically your dominant hand. And if you ain't got any hands, it's gonna go in the forehead, you know. And then uh, you got Neuralink, all right, being ready to be used on people. So hey, like this, the technology's here already. 17 and that no man might buy or sell save he that had the mark or the name of the beast or the number of his name so this 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 mark that's going to be given to all you know no matter who you are poor broke rich free in jail all right it's going to be implemented the hour of temptation which shall come upon the whole world I believe that's Revelations 3. Okay. And the purpose of this device is that nobody's going to be able to buy or sell unless they have it. 
All right, so you're not going to be able to go on to your Walmart and steal. You ain't even be able to get into the store if you don't got it. All right, a lot of people are going to be stealing <laughs> in, inside the parking lot. <laughs> the ones who don't take it. All right, but for the ones who do, you know, you're not going to be able to buy or sell unless you have that. Okay. Uh, let me see. Uh, yeah, let's get that Revelations 3. This is Revelations 3 and 10. Because thou hast kept the word of my patience, I also will keep thee from the hour of temptation, which shall come upon all the world to try them that dwell upon the earth. All right, so that hour of temptation is when this technology all right is is implemented and made mandatory look you can't if you don't get it guess what you're going to be excommunicated from society you ain't and, and what's the perfect way of excommunicating somebody from society is not allowing them to buy or sell which would make it to where you can't provide for yourself um feed your family feed yourself pay uh your bills your utilities your whatever your rent mortgage have a place over your head that's all going to be stripped all right and like uh apostle tahar says you know he believes when they implement the chip you know your howish is coming real soon all right quickly right behind that because you know, Matthew's uh, 24 chapter said, if, uh, you know, the days aren't shortened for the elect's sake, no flesh shall be saved. So things are going to pick up quickly because if it doesn't, guess what? How, who's he, how is I going to come back to save? <laughs> All right. Because the elect, they're not going to, you know, the, the one third, the elect, they're not going to take this device. You know, and Esau is going to be um, beheading, you know, the believers and um tossing some of the ones who don't take the uh the device in these FEMA camps and these concentration centers you know Yahweh I will have to come shortly after if not there won't be nobody left to be saved from the hopeful elect all right It's the love of money. <clears throat> this is Timothy, 1 Timothy 6 and 10. For the love of money is the root of all evil. And the purpose Esau is doing this, all right, he wants to be, he wants to be God. So, you know, he, um, he wants to get everybody uh, microchipped, all right? He wants C-hipped. All right, he wants everybody to take his device um, in order to, to function. All right. But um, the love of money is the root of all evil. All right. But check this part out, which while some covet after they have erred from the faith and pierced themselves through with many sorrows. <laughs> and how do you receive that mark? by getting it pierced getting it let's see the picture now right, you see this right here what does that look like happening he's getting he's getting pierced he's getting that palisade that uh karox all right and it's gonna be because what a lot of people are gonna want to keep their money oh i have a hundred thousand i have whatever it is you know a lot of people are gonna take it because they don't they don't want to lose their money all right. They care and, and love money too much to the point where, you know, it blinds them. All right. To the point where, you know, hey, we're going to they're going to take it and ultimately receive the, the wrath that's to come along with receiving it. All right. So look, when that's when this the change comes, hey, fuck this money. This ain't even real money. This shit's paper. This shit's monopoly money. This it's 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 a board game to Esau. This ain't even real money. Real money is precious metals, stones, land, cattle, livestock. You know that's that's real uh, money. You know, gold and silver. 
All right, that's what wealth is. All right, what we're using is a debt-based system that's not backed up by anything. So, you know, here it is. You want to be destroyed for something that doesn't even have any value to it. All right, let's get the destruction. For the ones who do take this device, this is going to be the outcome. Revelations 14 and nine. It says, and the third angel followed them, saying with a loud voice, if any man worship the beast and his image and receive his mark in his forehead or in his hand. Now, see, this one lets us know hand. It doesn't say right hand, which that just basically goes into your, your dominant hand. Right. For the most part, you know, people are right handed. All right. So it's going to be mostly right handed. People are getting it in the right hand. But, you know, you do have others that are lefties. It don't matter what hand it is. It's whatever hand it's in. You're still going to get destroyed. You could take it in your butt cheek. You're going to be destroyed. All right. For you uh, goofy IUIC Israelites. Verse 10, the same shall drink of the wine of the wrath of God, which is poured without mixture into the cup of his indignation. And he shall be tormented with fire and brimstone in the presence of the holy angels and in the presence of the lamb. All right. So what's that talking about? That's that talking about that, that, that judgment, the nuclear missile that's going to be launched. The, the missiles that are going to be launched to America, which is also known as Babylon, the daughter of Babylon, right? And it's going to be completely burned up. All right. But none of that's going to happen until, you know, this uh, the radio frequency identification device is implemented. You're going to have um, you're going to need it to buy and sell. All right. It looks like from that video, Walmart starting next year, they're going to be having all their products locked down. So, you know, that means it's going to be uh, somebody in this shit damn near each aisle trying to open it up for you. The The easiest way would be like, well, let's just have them have to check in with the device. And now we know who's in our store and then we could charge them based off of that, you know. All right. And all these things are, are, are coming to the near future. All right. And we need these things to come to pass. RFID chip. All right. Which will lead into World War Three, which we're. Uh, you know, that's brewing up and ultimately the famine of the word leading up to, to Jacob's trouble, leading up into FEMA camps, martial law, up into the the uh, the destruction and salvation simultaneously. <laughs> All right, as the destruction is coming, Yahweh is coming to, to save his uh, his elect, the one third. All right. As it says in uh, Revelations, come out of her, my people. All right. So while this uh, so you don't be partakers of her plague. So while the missiles are coming and everybody's scrambling, oh, my God, uh, they're going to receive that judgment. The elect are going to be saved. Yeah, how willing this was edifying to next time. Shalom.